this bustling city, the industrial city of Calabarzon, is now home to the hottest team of the Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League. Nandito tayo sa Batangas City Coliseum, ang home ng Batangas City Tanduay Athletics, the only unbeaten team so far dito sa Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League. Ito ang Liga ng Bawat Pilipino. We're coming to you live here sa Batangas City uh, on ABS-CBN Sports and Action and of course, our Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League Facebook page. Batangas City Tanduay Athletics staking their unbeaten record laban dito sa Paranaque Patriots. Magandang gabi, Pilipinas, and a warm welcome dito sa Batangas City. Sa Delf Tupas kasama ang ating PBA legend, Coach Rodney Santos. And Coach Rodney, of course, yung fans dito excited na para makita muli ang kanilang home team na wala pang talo dito so far sa ating Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League season. 4-0 ang standing nitong uh, Batangas. Anong nakikita mo sa kanila na nagugustuhan mo? Yes, again, uh, sa Derp, no, yung they're trying to extend their winning streak, no, yung uh, Batangas, and lalo na ngayon, they're playing their uh, home court advantage, no, so nandyan yung excitement, nandyan yung mga, uh, siyempre, nandyan ang mga family nila, nandyan ang kaibigan nila, so they're trying to extend their winning streak, no, and uh, maganda dito is, uh, maganda yung... Uh, killer instinct nila eh, uh -huh. knowing that they're 4-0 headed to this game, no? Uh, kung baga, makikita mo yung pagiging uh, mix ng veterano at yung killer instinct ng team, lalo na siyempre, start from their coaching staff, uh, lalo na ngayon, na uh, siyempre, nandiyan, nanonood si Gov and Congressman, uh -huh. uh, magandang uh, moral booster yun para sa team. Well, they would need a morale boost here. 4-0 ito, Batangas Athletics unbeaten so far. They're coming off a big win away dun sa Navotas uh, last Saturday. Ito naman, Pananaki Patriots kagagaling lang sa talo last week dun sa kanilang home floor sa Olivares College Gym. 2-2 two two naman ito, Pananaki Patriots. No, one, one, ano sila eh, Pananaki Patriots hindi makausad eh. 1-1 one, one, yes. tapos na, 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 nanalo na naman 2-1 two, tapos 2-2 two, two ulit. So, uh, naghahanap sila ng momentum dito. They're trying to uh, achieve their first winning streak starting with this game against the Batangas Athletics and itong Batangas of course hindi sila magpapatalo on their home floor yes sayang yung ano eh sayang yung last game ng uh, Paranaque Patriots no siguro kung nakuha nila yan this could be a, uh, a very crucial a very good game for them kasi at least makakuha sila ng moral booster beat by beating this uh, Batangas on their home court well fine reliables itong matchup natin Gap, Dagangon and Balacuna Halos parehong style of play itong dalawa players na to. Yes. And they will be under the microscope tonight. Titingnan natin yung matchup na yan uh, for the rest of the night. Uh, alam natin, nagap dagang o napaka-importante player dito sa Paranaque. Oo, oh, ito si Balacuna, ganun din. Yes. And, uh, yeah, look, magandang matchup to. Oh, look for them to uh, really step up in this ball game. As we take a look at the last game itong Paranaque, uh, they were in control most of the way in, against the Quezon City Capitals, Royal Manila, and all of a sudden, nag-collapse sila ng fourth quarter. Yes, oo. Uh, saya, maganda na sa aming momentum, no? Well, tendency talaga ng team, no? They collapse on the fourth. Well, if you don't have the experienced players, talaga magtutuloy-tuloy. Well, ito nga, ang uh, erratic nga sila nung game na yun. And although in their home floor, they weren't able to get that win against the Quezon City uh, Capitals, Gap Dagang on 12 points and 10 rebounds. Yes, Jamal Bascara, 12 points, but a 3 of 12 field goals. Yes, medyo mataas yun, ano? Uh, sayang yung game ni Gabriel dahil uh, he had a double-double. Oh, oh, and it, the turnovers hurting itong uh, Patriots and the fast break points, hindi sila masyado tumatakbo, Coach Rodney. Kaya nga, eh, may siguro uh, very comfortable on the half-court set. Oh, oh, 4 of 5 free throws and mabigat itong talo itong uh, Paranaque Patriots. They will look to bounce back, of course, against the league leaders and it's not an easy task, especially dito sa home floor itong uh, Batangas City, Tanduay Athletics. Napakabigat ng kalaban itong uh, Paranaque Patriots. Pag-usapan natin itong Batangas uh, City, Tanduay Athletics. Parang lahat nag-contribute dito yes, sa team oh, na to. Uh, equal uh, scoring opportunity ang nangyayari sa Batangas. No? Kaya, as you can see, they were the only team unbeaten, sabi mo nga. Uh, kasi lalo na uh, yung killer instinct nila. Oh, Tsaka malalaki sila na tumitira sa labas. Oh, Balacuna was instrumental in that win. Pero ang best player natin doon last game was Jemo Igilos. J 
Jamo Igilos doing it on both ends na to score but at the yes, same time rim, prote rim protector din para yes. sa ano sa Batangas he had 9.5 points per game and 9.25 rebounds per game yeah, very crucial you talk about killer instinct yung nakikita mo ang kanilang uh, stats dyan 78.8 points per, per game, game. Pero they holding their opponents to 66.3. So, malaki yung difference, 12 point gap yun. It's, it's either pangit yung offense ng kabila or maganda yung depensa nila. Uh, punta tayo sa ating kasama sa coverage, our courtside reporter, Nikki Viola, who is uh, with our two coaches for tonight. Yes, it's up, Coach Rodney. Ngayon, kasama ko ang ating dalawang coaches na maglalaban for the second game tonight dito lamang sa MPBL. And ngayon, syempre, kung ayaw muna natin si Coach Mac from Batangas. Hello po. Magandang gabi, Coach Mac. Good evening po. Po sa mga viewers. Alright, so tanong ko po, you are the undefeated team dito sa ligang ito. So, uh, lalo na ngayon, I think it's a home court advantage. Ano po ba yung uh, paghahandang ginawa ninyo para maipanalo ang uh, larong ito ngayong gabi? Well, I just told the guys, no, um, to keep uh, play hard. Well, actually, we don't stop working. Because, syempre, hindi sila, mahirap kalaban sila, Coach Arik. Well, you know, experience-wise, wala pa ako kay Coach Arik. Well, what I'm trying to tell my team right now, is talagang work hard, play hard, 40 minutes. That's it. All right, so thank you so much for that, Coach Mac. And of course, good luck sa larong ito. All right, so ngayon, kasama naman natin si Coach Arik ng Pananyak. Eh, so, Coach, you will be playing against the undefeated team ngayong gabi. So, ano po ba ang paghahandang ginawa ninyo? Wala naman kung sinabi sa mga player ko, doon sa isayon namin, kako, kailangan yung mas malalak, maraming malaki ang, 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 ano, ang Batangas, they have to box out. Tapos yung mga shooter nila, kailangan kung natin bigyan kumpiyansa, kailangan kumpiyansa pa lang i-stop na natin. Alright, so Coach, maraming maraming salamat and good luck po sa game ninyo ngayong gabi. Send up with Coach Rooney, back to you. Thanks, Nikki. Just a waiting tip-off here. And nandiyan yung ating first five. Gab Dagangon starting with Jose Koga, Daniel De Guzman, Jonathan Villorio, and Jamal Vizcara para sa Paranaque Patriots. Batangas Athletic Standway starting with the veteran Lester Alvarez and Bala Cunha. Jamo Igilos, the best player from the last game, is by the man in the middle. Mark Olayon and Paul Varilla are the two forwards. Our first five is brought to you by Tandway Rum. Five years. T by Nang Loob, T by Tandway. And Lester Alvarez collects the tip. Paul Varilla now. Anong kailangan gawin dito ng uh, Paranaque Patriots para mapigilan itong uh, winning streak itong uh, Batangas sa uh, Coach Rod? Well, sa tingin ko, yung uh, rebound, no? Kasi, oh, as you can see, yeah. isang height ng uh, Batangas. Parang ano eh, no? Ganun sila eh, no? Yes, Parang no. Uh, magkaka-height yung mga players dyan. No wonder, they're four zero. Oh, and, and of course, no? Matagal na rin nagkakasama itong mga, mga players ng uh, Tanduay. Very familiar with each other. Yeah, almost in tough. Oh, Gab Tagangon, the matchup we've been looking out. Hindi uh, pumasok yung kanyang layup. Ulayon drops it off to Igilos, but blocked up top by uh, De Guzman. Tagangon took some extra steps there, pero walang tawag. Koga. Surveys the floor. Binalik kay Bilorio. He'll take the three. Pasok yan! Galing kay uh, Jonathan Bilorio. Ang ganda, ng, uh, ang ganda panoorin ng Batangas kasi ang lalaki nila and they're running the floor. Oh, but naunahan sila dito ng Paranaque Patriots. 3-0 ang ating score. Bala Cunha. Nakakuha ng pick. Tumira ng tres. It's a good shot but uh, sorry miss for Acuna. Lester Alvarez. Pasok yan yes. ang kanyang uh, short jumper. A very uh, veteran player so Batangas. Ito si uh, Lester Alvarez. Uh, hindi ganun kaganda yung pinakita niya sa last game nila. He uh, wants to bounce back from that uh, poor shooting yung uh, nangyari kay Lester Alvarez. Hindi naman, hindi naman talaga, you know, hindi naman uh, ganun kasama ang laro niya. But hindi lang mga pasok hindi lang kanya, lang oh, pasok. yung kanyang tira. Well, Lester. well, you hope you have that uh, those nights, no? talagang off night, hindi ka tawag. Ang punya, binigay kay Ulayon. He's getting a rare start here. They're running a, a hand of play. Oh, binigay kay Acuna. Oh, acrobatic wow. shot. Igilos. Deep si do, sayang. Parang hindi uh, expect na pumasok ang tira na yun. 
Bilorio swings it over to Dagangon for three. That's good! Yan ang uh, isang player na dapat tingnan ng Batangas, no? Very strict shooter once he gets it going. 6-2 to two ang ating score. Gusto yata niya itong Paranaque, patahimikin agad itong uh, crowd dito sa yes. Batangas City. Coliseum, but Lester Alvarez makes sure na hindi yan mangyayari. He rings the bell his first three of the night. Nasa kanya yung unang limang puntos ng Batangas. Alam mo, if you're playing uh, against the home court team, no? You do not get the crowd involved. Oo. Uh, Vizcara. Yans Ulayon. Okay, uh, De Guzman. Daniel De Guzman. One-handed shot. Hindi pumasok. See, Ula Ulayon Batangas streaking. is running. No? Maganda ng outlet pass nila. Pass there from Alvarez, the court vision from uh, the former Adamson guard. Nasa ilalim na naman ng bola. Nice defense by Acuna. Again, they're running. Triple from Acuna. Tapos, Ulayon has four points to his name as uh, Batangas takes a 9-6 lead here. Makikita mo talaga ang Batangas. Very team talaga sila. The way they move the ball. Mactan has made sure that the uh, well-oiled machine ng takbo nitong team niya, Koga. They go to Bilorio. He'll take the three. This time, hindi pumasok. Rebound ni Igilos. They're playing a uh, man-zone defense. Lester Alvarez nagmamadali. Tumira na three points. Lester Alvarez. Ayan na. And an Sisimula early, na. Uh, early timeout here para sa Batangas. Eight points. Agad-agad ang pinukol nito si Lester Alvarez. Lamang ang uh, Batangas City, Tadway, 12-6, to laban sa Paranaque Patriots. Back here, dito sa Batangas City Sports Center. And the keys yes. to the game, uh, uh, Coach Rodney, you can break this down for us. Yes, uh, siyempre, advantage ng uh, Baranaque Patriots. Ito ay lang pagiging veteran coach in Garik Ilagasario, no? And of course, the pressure defense naman ng Batangas ang mga kailang panlaban. And yun nga, great grind under pressure. Yun yung ginagawa dito ng... Batanga City, Tanduay Athletics, uh, so far sa tournament, ride with the crowd and of course, avoid complacency. Hindi talaga sila pwedeng mag-relax dito, especially against a very good team in the Paranaque Patriots. Na alam nila na very uh, powerhouse din. Oo. Off that Hand early, play for Koga. Off that early timeout, binigay kay Gab Dagangon yung bola. Tapos yung kanyang uh, three-point shot, rebound bala kunya. Go down low to Igilos against De Guzman. Jimo Igilos, the former FEU Tamarau turnaround shot, no good. Rebound Vizcara, the former UST Growling Tiger. Yes. Hindi na masyado umigot yung bola dun sa Batangas. So he took a bad shot. Dito ngayon kay Gap Dagangon. To Kogal, six seconds to shoot. Blocked by Lester Alvarez. Alvarez. See, they're running. And nakita mo doon. Defense to offense. Balacuna completing the fast break. Alam mo, Sadal, Dagangon is not really a, a pick-and-roll player. So he should be spotting up on his position.